So this is the Saddleback Leather Three Ring Binder in dark coffee brown. Purchased this um, for uh, $229 in July of 2022. It's currently August of 2023, so I've had it for just over a year. Um, I bought this binder uh, because I kind of wanted a place to just store just really important things in, um, you know, documents, uh, in my life, you know, stuff that, uh, for my, my business stuff that, uh, I would need, you know, to have all in one spot. Um, I just wanted one central location for the, all that stuff. And so I figured, Hey, you know, this is another <laughs> opportunity to spend money on leather stuff that I probably don't need, but I'm going to get anyway, because, um, I like it a lot. So, um, it's great. It's held, uh, held closed. It's, it's empty right now, which is why this thing is so far in here. Normally it's expanded a bit cause it has stuff in it. So it's like that, but, um, so it looks like empty, um, spine here. Uh, he, this was designed, Dave mentioned, you can replace the, the three ring unit in here if you need to, which is smart. That way if that ever goes out, you can just get a new one. Um, it's pretty standardized. I understand it's riveted here, so it's super strong. Um, this was actually the first Saddleback uh, item I got that had the, the newest logo. Uh, I like the old one. Uh, Dave, if you're watching this, I wish you'd go back. Um, to that logo. I really like that one a lot more, but that's okay. I'll still buy stuff from it. Anyway, um, or, you know, give the option, sell in both, sell this kind and then sell this other one. Anyway, um, this is a spot for all kinds of cards. I noticed these are really kind of tight. Like most things in leather, if you just use them a lot, they'll stretch out more. You can kind of see, um, you know, I've used the first couple ones. I haven't, I don't think I've stored anything in this one, which is why it's not as uh, stretched. Um, I, I don't know. I don't, I have some cards and stuff that I put in here, but I personally don't need all of this card area. Uh, but I guess it's nice to have, um, you have this bigger area down here. What do I keep in that? Uh, oh, I keep a, a checkbook in here. So that's nice. Um, yeah, you know, these are kind of tight at first. They're uh, they just need to stretch a bit. You got this big area back here for, you know, an iPad or a tablet or something. Put a pen up here in this loop. Uh, this is all kind of reinforced with, I believe this is uh, veg tanned leather. Um, all this lighter stuff here, it's pretty tough. It kind of gives it some structure. Um, this is kind of a smart design, I think. Right in here, you have the spine is reinforced, but not over where it needs to bend to close. Um, so it's not, it's not like you're like trying and using all your muscle to close it. It's just, you know, it'll just flop closed. So that's nice. Um, and then of course the three ring section of it is bolted onto the back. Um, this is a D ring. So that kind of makes more efficient use of the space. I think then you got back here, another flap, you can, um, you know, store documents in there. You could, put a notepad that had a cardboard back back here if you wanted to, um, whatever you wanted to do. It's pretty spacious. Uh, I keep, grab it really quick. Uh, it's gonna look kind of gnarly, but I keep all this stuff in there. I don't, you know, it's kind of funny having this colorful, cheap looking plastic in a binder like this. Uh, but I, I wanted something that, you know, that had, you know, zippable pouches. So I, I'll keep receipts in here. Um, and then I also have other, you know, areas that, um, are more like folders. So, um, you can store documents in them. So it's a mix of both. Maybe, maybe Saddleback will come out with a set of leather <laughs> organizers. I don't know, uh, but leather binder organizers, that might be too much, but, um, it's great. You know, if you've got some money to burn or whatever, uh, and you just want a nice binder that can kind of be the, you know, center point of your organization, uh, the, the center, the, yeah, the, the center of your, uh, of your universe in terms of, uh, documents and organization, this can kind of be the, 
the place where you go or you know to find all your stuff um, I actually had a gift certificate from one of the photo contests I think that I had won and so I just I wanted one of these I actually had to wait a long time to get it they were out for a few months um, so I just kind of sat on that for a bit till they were back in stock and then I got one um, I don't know if I would have Spent the cash on a leather, you know, a $230 leather binder. Eh, I don't know. Um, but that's just me. Um, but I'm glad I have it. You know, it's definitely if you have a gift card or some, you know, giving a gift or something, it's, it's great. It's strong. I haven't used it all that much. It just kind of sits in here. I haven't had to, you know, I get it into it every now and then, but I really don't use it all that much. Um, at least it's it's used, but it's not uh, it's not handled all that much. I'm not going into it all that much because it's just storing stuff for me, and when I need access to that stuff, that's I just go to it. So um, I also don't have a uh, you know I don't have a real need to use it every day. My job, um, you know, I fly airplanes for a living. I don't really need a binder for work. Um, if you're someone who uh, is in binders a lot for work, then absolutely this would be, um, you know, probably the best one you could ever get because it's got a hundred year warranty on it. So um, anyway, this is the, the three ring leather binder from Saddleback. If you have any questions about it, just leave a question in the comment section um, and uh, I'll get back to you. Uh, thanks for watching.